Hey y'all, it's Alyssa aka Bangs and Glasses back again with a haul video for you guys. I've got some stuff uh, that I picked up at Michael's uh, from their like clearance stuff and then I've got an order uh, from CheapScrapbookStuff.com I believe it is the name. Yeah, Cheap Scrapbook Stuff. That is the name. Okay. So let's start with the Michael stuff first. I went, this is early December, and I've just had this stuff, so just thought I'd show you guys. I've picked up these foam pumpkin stickers on clearance. I think I got them for like 50 cents, um, and you get 120 pieces in there. I like to send stuff like this in Happy Mail, so I got those. I also got these um, celebrated picks. I got the sunflowers and the turkeys. I think for, gosh, I don't remember what I got them for. Probably like a quarter or less, honestly, because um, they were marked down like 90%. And then I picked up some more of the dollar clearance stickers. I got these owls. I got these ghosts, which are so cute. I got these for Valentine's Day. I got these fun rainbow unicorn stickers with the googly eyes got these graduation owls these halloween stickers got these foam glittery hearts from k and company and these heart gems from julie's boutique and that's what i picked up at michael's um again that was all really cheap. I think I got all of that stuff for like $9. And then I have some stuff that I picked up from CheapScrapbookStuff.com. They are really awesome. Um, really great prices. And this ships super quickly. I was very surprised. I think I ordered it just a couple days ago and it's already here. And that is really surprising considering how the mail is going <laughs> right now. Um, so yeah, I got a lot of stuff in this order. This is a collection that I decided to pick up that I thought would be so cute for, um, just kind of scrapbooking everyday life. It's from Damask Love, um, and I know her stuff is available at Joann's, and this is the Write at Home collection. It's not a new collection, but, um, it's new to me. So I got the project pad. And I wasn't sure what actually came in the project pad because um, it doesn't say online uh, what's included. Like you don't get to see the inside. So I thought I'd show you guys on camera because it's very unique and I really like it. Um, so this collection has a lot of like food themed things. This is the um, sticker sheet in the front. A lot of really punny stickers. Uh, things that say like, uh, we're a perfect fit, um, you're the sweetest with some honey, love all the little food stickers, there's like laundry themed stuff, and just like everyday life. This next sheet is also a sticker sheet, it's got some really fun alphas here, um, and then these I believe are mailing labels, so you can um, write uh, like your to and from on here, these are really cute as well. Then we get into some of the paper. We've got bacon and eggs. Love that. And then they have these really interesting uh, punch out sheets. And they're all like cards. Like you can just punch this out and fold it in half and make it a card. And then it's got all this other ephemera and like a saying you can put in the card. Like you're my bae, bacon and eggs. Uh, it's really cute. I love all the like... Uh, breakfast themed items. This is my favorite sheet. It's just all these fun breakfast foods like pancakes and waffles and cereal and you even got a toaster in there and it says seriously like seriously. Love that and it's got some uh, silver foiling on there. Next is this sheet, a really good background paper. And then we have another one of those punch out sheets. This one is actually a t-shirt. Uh, so you can fold it in half and make it a card and you can have it say uh, we're a perfect fit or uh, just like hello happy birthday 
really cute. Next, we've got some stars. Got this page with an aloe vera card, and you can have it say you're unbelievable or aloe you vera much or a belief in yourself. So cute. And we got this page, which is some really simple grid with some silver foiling. At this page with a uh, jean pocket card, you could have it say, uh, hey, smarty pants. That would be cute. And some different laundry themed things. At this page with all the clothes on there and the washing machine. Have this avocado card. You could have it say, avo, great birthday. And then we've got some avocado paper. This one's one of my favorites. We got the honey shaped card. You could have it say you're the sweetest or hey honey bear. We got these cute little cookies and pies and cakes. So cute. I love this paper too. It's milk and cookies. So fun. Okay, and then we have two glitter papers. We have a silver glitter and then this really bright uh, kind of purpley pink paper it looks more pink pink on my camera but it's more of a purpley pink and then we just have some plain colored cardstock they also included this um, envelope template in the back so not wasting any packaging so these are the solid color cardstocks which are great just really usable colors so yeah that is the project pad for Damask Lab right at home and then I got some of the ephemera and some loose sheets. So I got the ephemera pack. It's got 40 pieces. I'm actually gonna open it because it doesn't show you uh, what it is on the back and I wanted to look at it. So I'll look at it with you guys. So there's the little pieces and then we got the bigger pieces. It looks like they're mostly food. I'm sure it's a lot of the same icons that we saw in the sticker sheet. Got a banana, a radish, clothespin, plant, some bleach. This is bleach, please. I love that. Got some more house plants. Happy birthday. Got the cute little honey bear. Congrats. More clothespins, those are fun. Got a thank you, a tea kettle, a pizza cutter, that's cute. You got a cheese grater and a whole like silverware set, that's cute, and a washing machine. And then for the little smaller ephemera, we've got a cookie, a rainbow cookie, got a soup can, <laughs> I have um, a beater. Got a kitchen scale, we got a knife, got a measuring cup, a little plant, a sock, watermelon, got um, a oven mitt, some juice boxes, those are cute, I got a cookie, a lemon, some peanut butter, an egg, an avocado, little cactus, some bacon, and it says, hey, homegirl. <laughs> That's cute. I thought this would, collection would just be really cute since um, this year we've been spending time mostly at home. Like, this is a good collection to use to kind of document that. And then I got some of the um, embellishments. I did get the shaker embellishments. I love this coffee pot and the bacon and eggs and toast. So I got those and then I got these wood stickers. I actually thought they were going to be bigger, um, but they're still really cute. We got a grocery bag here and I really like the tea kettle. Got some orange juice and a wobble and these are wood dimensional stickers. And then I got um, the 6x12 cardstock stickers and you get a lot on here. Um, this is the first side. I really like this wobble. Um, what else did I really like on this page? I really like this peach jar and the coffee ground bag. 
And then this is the reverse side, a lot of different icons and some word stickers. You're the greatest, that's cute with a little greater. And then I just got some of the loose papers because um, I wasn't sure what papers were included in the project pad. Um, so this is the first one I got. It is called, let's see, Wet the Fork. And it's got all these kitchen utensils. And then this is the back side. I did get um, two of each of the papers. And I love the branding strips that um, they're solid. So you can definitely use them um, as embellishments. And then this next one, this is the front side. Got all kinds of fruits and veggies. And that one's called Let the Beat Drop. <laughs> This is so fun. And then this is the back, just like a really nice picnic blanket pattern. And then the top is a strip of the um, utensils. This one was my favorite. This is bacon and eggs and some pink. And we've got this kind of tone on tone text print. It's just all different uh, like kitchen related sayings. Um, like. This kitchen is our playground, create memories, love, remember, home is where the heart is. Really cute. And that's the brandy strip on top of that one. And that is everything I got from the Right at Home collection. Super excited to add that to my crafty stash as I begin um, scrapbooking just more like everyday life. Um, I've been really into scrapbooking lately, so I'm excited to continue that. And then I got um, some 12 by 12 papers from the All Heart collection because I actually did not have any of the All Heart paper at all. I have a lot of the um, embellishments and I have the chipboard pack and the washi, but I did not have any paper to go with it. So I wanted to pick that up and they actually had these um, on sale for 25 cents each, you guys. And it's double-sided cardstock paper. So I got the specialty sheet which will be fun to uh, cut apart. And it's got that hollow foil. I got two of this sheet, which is called Rosie. It's a front and the back. We got a nice chevron. It's a good background paper. This one is one of my favorites. Got the really pretty floral pattern. This one's called Wallflower. And just like some really simple polka dots. I love this one as well. You could cut it apart or use it as a background. This is the front and the back side. And this one is called Selfie. Got this one, which is really pretty, like mandala pattern with uh, the realistic flowers. This one's called Wild. And this is the back, just like some really simple um light pink dots this one i only got one of for some reason i think maybe because i didn't like it that much i don't know but that's that pattern and then the other side is just some simple uh pink with some dashes then we got this one with the rainbow pattern and then the rainbow stripes on the other side this one's called be you I love this paper. This paper, I feel like you could just like put your photo right here and you're done. Like you don't have to add anything to it. This one is called Shine On. So that's the front and the back and I got two of those. Next, I got um, this one called Go Girl. All these fun sayings that you could fussy cut out. And then the back is just a really simple grid pattern. Let's see, I think I got two more. This one is called Cute Stuff, all the different icons that you could cut out. And the back is just uh, pink stars. And last one from this collection uh, is Peace Out with the peace sign. And then the back is navy and pink uh, plus signs. Okay, so that's everything from All Heart. Next, I got some 12 by 12 sheets from the Crepe Paper um, Wild Heart collection. 
um oh excuse me i misspoke earlier so the ones from wild heart this collection were 25 cents the ones from all heart were 89 cents each excuse me and um i got these again because i have the rest of the collection i have this six by eight paper pad but i did not have any 12 by 12 uh, so i just wanted to pick up a couple of those and again i got two of each this one is called days of the sunnies and then it's kind of grid pattern on the back I have this one which I really like this side of it's called hustle it's the front and this is the back this one's kind of odd I'd probably use this as um, like for matting photos then we have this one which is called planted it's the front and this is the back Got this one with the leopard print it's called roar it's the front and the back and then this one which this one's a really great background paper and it's called electric electric and that's all I got from that collection and then these were in the 25 cent section um, and I only meant to order one. I guess I ordered two on accident, uh, but it's a foiled shield paper. It's got gold foiling. I thought it would be cute um, to add into like my Harry Potter stuff or um, for like Renaissance fairs or stuff like that. And yeah, that is everything I got. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll see you again in the next crafty video. Bye!